he was the sponsor of the Gang of Eight bill that did did require uh, a, a bunch of thresholds, but it ultimately allowed for citizenship over an extended period of time. I mean, that's that's a fact. And um, he asked me to support that, and I I supported him because I think people, when you're elected. You need to do things. And he led the charge to finally fix this immigration problem that has existed now for us, as Marco says, for 30 years. And then he cut and run because it wasn't popular amongst, uh, amongst conservatives, I guess. Here's what I believe. And I wrote a book about this called Immigration Wars. You can get it at $2.99 on Amazon. It's not a bestseller, I can promise you. There won't be any, you can get it. It's, it's affordable for everybody. We should have a path to legal status for the 12 million people that are here illegally. It means come out from the shadows, pay a fine, earn legal status by working, by paying taxes, learning English, not committing crimes, and, and, and earn legal status when you're not cutting in front of the line for people that uh, are patiently waiting outside. That is the, I think that's the conservative consensus, pragmatic approach to how to solve this problem. Go ahead, Senator. It's interesting that Jeb mentions the book. That is the book where you changed your position on immigration because you used to support a path to citizenship. So did you. Well, but you changed the yeah. and the book. So did you, Marco. 